day everyone, I am Joanna Ivy M. Ramos from BSN3 Black Tea of the College of Nursing at Nueva Ecija University of Science and Technology. For today's video, I will be performing the administration of oxygen using a nasal cannula or a mask. So, the goal of this procedure is the patient should exhibit an oxygen saturation level within acceptable parameters. For the equipment, we must check for the oxygen delivery devices as ordered by the healthcare provider, oxygen tubing, consider extension tubing, humidifier if indicated, sterile water for humidifier, oxygen source, oxygen flow meter, and appropriate room signs. So for the implementation of the procedure, first bring necessary equipment to the bedside stand or over bed table. Perform hand hygiene and put on PPE if indicated. Identify the patient, close the curtains around the bed, and close the door to the room if possible. Next, explain what you are going to do and the reason for doing this to the patient. Review safety precautions if necessary when oxygen is in use. Place no smoking signs in inappropriate areas. Next, connect the nasal cannula to oxygen setup with humidification if one is in use. Adjust flow rate as ordered and then check that oxygen is flowing out of prongs. Place prongs in patient's nostrils. Place tubing over and behind each ear with adjuster comfortably under the chin. Alternately, the tubing may be placed around the patient's head with adjuster at the back or base of the head. Place gauze pads at ear beneath the tubing as necessary. Next, adjust the feet of the cannula as necessary. Tubing should be snug but not tight as against the skin. Encourage the patient to breathe through nose with the mouth closed. Reassess the patient's respiratory status including respiratory rate effort and lung sounds. Note any signs of respiratory distress such as tachypnea, nasal flaring, use of accessory muscles or dyspnea. Remove PPE if used, perform hand hygiene, and document the procedure. And that's all for today's video. Thank you so much for watching.